Many people said they'd hoped for a white Christmas this year, but many forget that while it looks extremely pretty, it can cause no end of problems. Flights from many of the major airports have been severely disrupted. EasyJet has been having huge problems at Gatwick and here at Luton. The budget airline is considering operating on Christmas Day to deal with the backlog. On the roads, councils have gone on the defensive over claims gritters haven't been fast enough. I am absolutely appalled at the state of the roads. I can't understand why it was left to get so bad. Vehicles stranded in what looked like icy car parks. Basingstoke in Hampshire was particularly affected. Somebody described it as looking like a disaster film with abandoned cars strewn across the roads. But John Ransford from the local government association says sometimes the weather wins the battle. The problem is that when you get a heavy snowfall at a very difficult time, a lot of the um, benefit of that treatment is lost because the snow falls too quickly. And drivers have been warned not to assume that all the roads will be clear by tomorrow morning. Slightly better news over at Eurostar, where passengers have finally been getting through the Channel Tunnel after days of suspensions. The first trains pulled out of St Pancras in London shortly before 8 o'clock this morning. But the company's chief executive has warned that services will not return to normal until after Christmas. As for the forecast, more snow showers are likely across parts of Scotland and Northern England.